Okay, so it is the beginning of a new month and we are now officially in the fourth quarter of the year. And of course, it's standard for me to say this in these videos, but time has flown by so quickly. And now we're in the fourth quarter of this year. But since it is the beginning of a new month, it's time for us to talk about comebacks that are happening this month. I probably don't have all of the comebacks that are happening this month, so if I missed any, please let me know. But starting on the 1st, which is when I'm uploading this, From Miss Nine is releasing an album called Talk and Talk. Uh, Lee Unsung is releasing an album called Beautiful Sunshine with the title track Lemonade. And then Luminous is releasing Youth. On the 2nd, Astro is releasing, I think, a single, correct me if I'm wrong, called Alive. And then Ace is releasing an album called Changer Dear Iris, Iris, spelled um, E-R-I-S. And then on the third, Lehigh is releasing an album called Four Only. Okay, so she's releasing MVs for two songs this month. On the third, she's releasing the title Savior, uh, the MV for Savior. And then also on the third, Hong Jung Juhyun is releasing Flower. I believe it's a single. I'm pretty sure it's a single, but I'll have to double check. Um, on the sixth, Stacy is releasing an album called Stereotype. And then on the sixth, we also have a solo debut. Um, Day Six's Young K is having his debut, like solo and he's releasing Eternal. And then Omega X is also releasing an album called What's Going On. Before this, I haven't actually heard of Omega X, but um, yeah, they're having a release this month. On the 7th, Super Junior Sungmin is releasing a song called Good Night Summer. When I heard about this, I was pretty surprised because you don't really hear of Suju's Sungmin very often after he basically left, not officially left, but he left the entertainment world after he got married back in 2014. And when I was looking, um, when I was looking him up, apparently he released a song back in 2019 and I had no idea. But then again, I have not re really been keeping up with Super Junior after Lo Siento, so. Am I really surprised that I didn't hear about Summing's um, first release? Not really. Um, but I'm super excited that he's releasing another song. Um, I know that he was really, I guess, ostracized by the fandom when he got married. So hopefully um, he's doing good. <laughs> Moving on, on the 8th, Purple Kiss is releasing their album Hide and Seek. On the 9th, Hyuna and John are having a release. I think it's absolutely so cute that they're still together and they're living their best lives at P Nation. Also on, on the 9th, Lehigh is releasing the MV of Red Lipstick, which is part of the album For Only. On the 10th, Blackpink's Lisa is having her solo debut with the single La Lisa and she has so much power like she set records with with her pre-order stuff and I love that for her um I love that her solo debut is being hyped up so much um so yeah I'm pretty excited to see what it's like once it's released um, on the 13th, ATs is releasing their album Zero Fever Part 3 Deja Vu. Um, on the 14th, Mono's Blue Letter album is being released. If I were still not on an album No Buy right now, I would definitely have purchased this um, album. But I am excited to listen to all the songs. On the 17th, NCT 127 is releasing their album Sticker. And then on the 24th, um, Itzy is releasing their album Crazy in Love with the title track Loco. But yeah, that 
is all of the releases that I am aware of for September. Please let me know if I missed any. But yeah, that's the end of this video. I, I'm just gonna say I'm pretty sure I'm gonna take a break for September. I just have not really been feeling inspired lately to make any videos, so I think I'm just gonna take a break for September. If I do end up uploading a video, it'll probably be more of like a one-off, but I just have not really been feeling like making videos. Um, so yeah, that is the end of this video, and I will see you guys pretty soon.